um, I'm realizing again that I have not introed or outroed this video, so I don't do forget to do it later. Hi, it's me, Tree. Um, today is September 22nd, so we're actually in the autumnal mode now. I'm just waiting for all the leaves to turn orange. <laughs> For those of you who are new to these shenanigans, I am a mixed media conceptual artist and illustrator and writer. I live in the great white north, northern woods of Wisconsin. It's a thing. And our. I don't know, what else do people want to know? I have a BA in Classics and History with a minor in Women's Studies and Honors. Um, I have a Master's in Literature. I have post-baccalaureate work in Sculpture. And about half a PhD in Art Education. So, to say I'm overeducated is being absolutely truthful, to be fair. I am also queer. I am a they-them. I am disabled. And so aggressively left-leaning that calling me an anarcho-communist would not be going far amiss either. Anarcho-communist. Anarcho-communist. I can say these words. I'm also a nerd and a geek and a dork. I'm a, I am the trifecta. See? See my, my croaky? The noble demons made? I love, I love him. All right, so I kind of got on here to, uh, I don't know, I, I I got new water brushes. I like the Kuretake um, water brushes, these things. Of course, I do not remember what they are called. Uh, come here, come here, packaging. Kuretake water brushes. Helpful. It, it, it would be more helpful if I... Red Japanese. But I like the Kurataki water brushes. Um, I got my first one in an art snacks box, which is this poor, poor child. Several years ago I got it. And this is where we are with it. It doesn't really water brush anymore. Um, it's worn down to nothing. So I ordered myself new ones which these are the exact same brush like same size same everything and look at those differences In addition to my stickers, I added a Paloma sticker here. She cute. I'm, I decided to put on my The Beast shirt. If you don't know what The Beast is. So, a million years later, because I had to hunt up my other battery, and my charger, and I forgot where they were, and, um, you know what? I think I have a note in my phone about where all that stuff lived, so that was bad of me for not remembering to look there, but yes, I, 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 I got myself new... Kurataki water brush pens. I actually have a second one of these coming in because this is my favorite size of them. That that was literally all I had left to say when my my camera died. Also, I'm I'm more than a bit frustrated today. Um, I had Friday 
um, this coming Friday, uh, doctor's appointments for biologically specific things, which I am not thrilled about because dysphoria and dysmorphia, and I don't like that I have them to begin with. Did I mention queer? I am non-binary. Hi. My body is a meat suit that I do not approve of. But because of biologically specific reasons, I had to reschedule it. And the person who did my rescheduling was giving me a hassle about it. So, grumpy squid. Started my day with a grump. I started yesterday with a panic attack and today with a grump. So, we're doing real good. So, since this is the intro, uh, here is the rest of the vlog. <laughs> Hello, welcome to a brand new studio vlog. Hello, Gremlin. Look at how soft. She's ignoring me giving you a massive art supply craft haul here of things that I have just been uh, getting and stockpiling. I've been ordering all this stuff myself, but I thought it might be just kind of fun to share it with you. I mean, I saw this fun pile. So, hi, it's me, Tree. Um, I just wanted to like pop in and do the thing while it was on my well, I was at the top of my mind that Elo, which is like an art artist, like specific sock med, um, decided to put me on their front page, which is kind of cool. I have like a little like recording of my phone I did that shows it. Um, so yeah, that's kind of cool. Okay, bye. Hello, it's your friendly neighborhood tree. Um, yes, much floof. So, I actually managed to do some adulting things today, uh, which is hard. Um, but one of the things I did was talk to the Brown County uh, Library in Green Bay and uh, see if we were having uh, Brown County Comic Con this year because we didn't last year because of the neighborhood pan pandemonium. And apparently we're not this year either. It's said on the website, my brain sometimes does not read things correctly or clearly. Uh, the joy of dyslexia. Um, so I had to email our coordinator, Andrea, to check because it's better to be obnoxiously overly cautious than to show up to a thing that is not happening. So Andrew was like, yeah, we're ca we've canceled it because we're not doing large in-person things, which totally makes sense. Uh, Brown County Library is a very old building. Um, it doesn't have really great ventilation and Comic-Con, particularly the artist alley for Comic-Con, is in the basement, which really does not have good ventilation. And October, it's like we could have it in, outside, I suppose, but October in Wisconsin is very dicey, S especially mid-October in Wisconsin. It's it's just too dicey to even try. Uh, so yes, we're going to try for next year. Um, I'm still waiting to hear back from uh, our coordinator for EgoCon, which the website says we're still having it. I I'm thinking if we're still having it, I need to not because, um, weirdly, Brown County Library felt safer to me than a hotel, um, word, conference center. Um, just because with the library, you know exactly who's coming in and why they're coming in. And with a conference center, convention center, that was the word I was looking for, convention center attached to a hotel in a college town 
Yeah. No, 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 no. I do not feel safe for that one. So if it's happening, I'm going to have to cancel. So basically that means there are no cons for me this year, which is perfectly fine because, boy, howdy, does the universe look just, like, not great for this right now. It's like, I know a lot of people are feel comfortable going out in the world with just their masks and their vaccinations, but... I do not because I have a very janky immune system and I'm already a fairly bad asthmatic. asthmatic. I, I don't need things to make my lungs worse. That is an update, the update. I also did um, my ML, Municipal Liaison Duties, uh, the beginning of them for National Novel, novel Writing <sighs> Words. National Novel Writing Month in November. So I I have done like a lot of things, including talking to the doctor's office today. I have done so many adulting things and my head hurts and the light being like in my face so that I am relatively well lit is just making it absolutely worse. So I'm gonna go and sit quietly in the dark and hopefully my head will calm down. Um, so yes, there we are. Bye. So I thought I'd just show a little bit of what, like, one of my sketchbooks looks like. Just not much. Nothing exciting. Just things I think about, things that I return to things I experiment with, things I doodle when I'm tired, yep, oops, evidently that was still wet, uh, this is what happens when you use water and pen and, and markers in your sketchbook, alright, bye. Of course, my brain just totally, like, <sighs> So, hi, it's me, Tree. Uh, do, 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 end of the month, Tree. I have things, sort of, maybe. So, I put together a Drawtober prompt list. I have it, like, posted on my various and sundry sock meds. Uh, but I'm calling it, I'm tagging it Tentacletober so that I can find it easily. It's like, um, Furry Little Pe Peach tagging hers Peachtober. Has nothing to do with the content of the thing, just with the person who's doing the thing. Um, but it's things that hunger and grow, so it's like carnivorous plants and goth plants and mushrooms. So, this is what we're doing. I I'm thinking I'm going to do them as, like, the little, like, snow globey landscapes I've been doing. That is my thought. But I don't know. And I might do like other draw tobers drawloweens too. Just, you know, to make me do something that's outside of what I typically do. Which is part of the point of the things. Um interestingly somebody on Twitter put together like a list of people who have prompts out and put me on it which is weird to me but okay so there we go uh i really need to edit this like today or tomorrow uh because it's the 29th so like if i want this to like go into the universe so that people know i have the prompt thing i should do it sooner rather than later Hello, it is Outro Tree, um, filmed the same day as Intro Tree because that's how we roll around here. Uh, thank you for watching, uh, enjoying, not enjoying, I don't know. You spent time watching my thing. Thank you very much.
Um, if you are interested in seeing what else I do in the universe, I am Tentacle Maid Studios or Tentacle Maid at all the sock meds that matter, including Artful, A R T F O L. I will try and remember to put like the card here or something. Uh, and Elo, which neither one of those things people who aren't artists are on, I don't think. But yes, pretty much everywhere. Uh, I take commissions, I have a red bubble that I occasionally remember to update. Uh, I have a shop on my website, tentaclemadestudios.com. Mm, yeah. Uh, I also have a Patreon and a Kofi. That's what I was trying to remember. At w um, I am Tentacle Made Studios at both Patreon and Kofi. If you would like to financially support these shenanigans I do put a lot of like it's like I, I, I'm weird about paywalls so like finished pieces go up but like Patreon gets like extra weird pieces like the backgrounds that I put my, on my pieces so those, sometimes I turn them into wallpapers on Instagram stories um, or the figure itself without a background or um, the line drawing so if you want to print it and color it yourself you can uh, so I do do like extra things for my patreon in addition to I have tiers that have stickers and prints and original artwork if you want to be that committed to sparkle motion but whatever you do you do you and know that the world is better for having you in it. So do good, be kind, be brave, encourage.